What are you doing here, Run Good? Why are you running it back? You know better. You did Hoppy Box. Came out on top. Jordan Love Auto at six. Couple other Jordan Love Silver Prism. You know it's hard to make your money back on Hobby Boxes in 2021 with everything overpriced. So, what the hell are you doing here? You know, you had a good run. One and done. You know, take your W. Why do Why do you gotta come back? Why do you Why do you, Why do you gotta get burned by Panini? Huh? You 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 gotta have a Justin Herbert Auto. You gotta have a Joe Burrow Auto. Huh? Gotta hit a big one on one. Can't just be happy with a Jordan Love to six auto. Gotta come back for more. You're glutton for punishment, huh? Just gotta gotta feel the sting, huh? Gotta gotta feel the sting from every product. Gonna gonna just uh, rip it when it's a hundred dollars more. You know, buy it for a hundred dollars more than you did a couple weeks ago. Yeah, yeah. One of those autos really gonna be a Joe Burrow? You really think so? You really think you're gonna hit one of the guys on the cover? I do it for the content. I do it for the fans. Let's get into it. What is going on YouTube? Run Good Life coming at you with a brand new video today and today is run it back season. Uh, not running back season hopefully, run it back season. Give me what I want! We're running it back after last week's box which was an absolute banger of Chronicles hobby. Uh, I did hit the Jordan Love score auto green number to six. I also hit a Jordan Love silver DeAndre, switch pa DeAndre, switch. DeAndre Swift patch auto to 25 in that one I believe. Uh, just an amazing box all the way around. I made some money on it, uh, thankfully. Again, like I said, very hard to do these days to make your money back and then make a little profit. You're really looking for that big kaboom, and thankfully I hit one in my first box, and then my, my brain started playing some tricks on me and said, hey, hey, we gotta run it back. We gotta do another one. We gotta run it back. As the market was saying, this product is hot, so now it is not a $500 product. It is now a $600 product. And my brain said, we got to run back. We got to go. We got to do it again. And so here we are. Hey, I'm just here so I won't get fined. Uh, box is now about $600 on the market. And uh, we are going to get two autos, one memorabilia. Um, we have a tough first box to top. I'll say that. But I'm happy to get into it. If you are excited for this box, go ahead. Give this video a like. Also hit subscribe if you are new here. Would very much appreciate that whole lot of good content coming out we have a lot of football coming up we have so many new products coming out in the next few weeks little light on baseball we have basketball pretty much every week uh every other week and then same with football it feels like we're just gonna get an onslaught of releases here in may into june we'll have score football on the channel at some point we have prism draft picks we have so much stuff coming up on the basketball side. We've still got the optic train. We've still got select. We have so much stuff coming out, but that's for another video. Without further ado, let's go ahead. $600 hobby box. Gonna try and run it back and um, hopefully no running backs. We are gonna get those six packs, 48 cards total, eight cards per pack. Uh, we will look for two autos. Hopefully sometimes some boxes they say have a third auto, but I have yet to see one myself you have to open one in our group breaks if you want to hang out with us in the group breaks every wednesday and saturday at 5 p.m on saturdays and 3 p.m on wednesdays all right without further ado let's go ahead see uh what we're gonna find see if we can hit another monster we're gonna kick off with a herbert that's probably a good start just a base justin herbert we've got stefan Diggs. is this gonna be our first auto First auto is going to be Brandon Ayuk to 149. So right out of the gate, we are going to hit an auto. Going to be Mr. Ayuk for the 49ers wide receiver. Um, Yeah, so we have one more auto coming. Hopefully it is an absolute banger. I need it! Uh, Ayuk going to be a sticker on the Gridiron Kings. Uh, we missed jersey number by like seven. So that is a little unfortunate. Let's see what else. Let's keep on moving. Chase Claypool, Julian Blackman. We have a numbered card that is going to be a Derrick Henry. That's going to be numbered to 199. We're going to have a first chrome. Going to be Jerry Judy on the Le Legacy and LaMichael P. Ryan. I really love the mixture of cards that you receive in this product. I've not done any retail as of yet, but I'm sure we will have it on the channel. 
Uh, we're seeing blasters start to roll out, so I believe Megas and Hangers and Cello Packs shouldn't be too far behind. Um, I never like, you know, in a six-pack box, I never like hitting the auto in the first pack. I like to, I like to save the suspense for last. TJ Hawkinson. I think we're going to have, do we have our second auto right here? Uh, two autos right out of the way. Going to be J.K. Dobbins. All right, I was just saying I don't like to hit the first auto, and we hit two autos right off the back. It's over. Go home. J.K. Dobbins, 28 of 75, going to be our second auto. I know a J.K. Dobbins collector, so that one might be headed to the East Coast. J.K. Dobbins, 28 of 75, second auto, two packs in and two autos. Uh, Dobbins and Ayuk. So in order to make our money back, we are going to have to hit pretty much a really big prism black at this point. My anxiety is up here right now. I uh, typically what we've seen, typically we've seen like one of the autos is usually a relic. So that one really caught me off guard right there. Not being a relic auto chase Claypool, Jalen Johnson, Brandon Ayuk and a clear Tua. All right, we'll take that. I did hit the numbered version of this in my last hobby box that was numbered to 49. So Tua, uh, playoff momentum. There are three acetate sets in this. I believe three. It'll be interesting to see what the retail exclusive sets are going to be, if there are going to be any. I think we have a prism black silver in here. So hopefully we can get a big one because our autos were not very good. Not horrible, but you know, obviously the appeal of this product is the big name quarterbacks. Let's go ahead and save that card for last. We've got Jordan Love on the Grid Iron Kings. We'll take that. Jerry Judy, another Tua. You are just going to get a ton of rookies. Pretty much only two base cards per pack with the base chronicles. And then all of the subsets are going to be rookie cards. Another Tua right there. Got, I'm really big on. I hope Jacob Eason gets some playing time in Indy. Um, not very big on Carson Wentz here myself. Um, and another J.K. Dobbins. All right. I like the clearly Don Russ this year. I really liked opening that for basketball. I think it, it works really well. You know, this Chronicle set is very different from the basketball version. Uh, let's see. So we're going this way. We're going the other way. All right. Silver. Gonna be Brandon Ayuk. Okay, so we clearly have a Brandon Ayuk box on our hand. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. And unfortunately, oof, that's horrible. Come on, Panini. Come on, Panini, $500, $600 hobby box, and we're just going to have a dent on the surface right there. Kind of see it right there. That's always frustrating because this is pretty much the premier chrome card in the set. You want to be hitting the prism blacks, and uh, it's really frustrating, actually. Just a nice big dent right there. So, uh, PSA 6. I don't, I don't know. You can't send cards to PSA. Uh, they, they don't want them. Uh, so we will set that there. Always a little disappointing. Uh, let's keep it rolling, though. Maybe we'll get a numbered Prism Black, and it'll all be good. We've got Randy Moss, Nick Chubb, Big Ben. We've got L <laughs> LK, J.K. Dobbins. So we've hit nothing but Dobbins and Ayuk in this box, it seems. There is a Jalen Hurts that is going to be on the Panini. We have a Drew Locke that is going to be numbered to 99. On the Chronicles Blue. We have a Justin Jefferson and a Zach Moss to end the pack. Jefferson going to be Prism Black and Clear Vision going to be the Moss on the Acetate. Surface looks a lot better on that one, thankfully. A lot better. Uh, my hands are all cut up. I don't know if you guys can tell, but my hands are all cut up from, uh, from cutting up boxes today. It was a uh, trash day today, so... Uh, when you have so much product coming in and so many things coming in and you stay at home, you get all those Amazon boxes and get nicked by the box cutter. Uh, Justin Jefferson going to be our second prison black. We have two packs left. It feels like this one has the relic. Let's go ahead. Save our relic for last. Maybe it is not a white paper nap napkin. Maybe it is a something very, very, uh, something very filthy. Uh, the only relics I've seen so far have all been numbered to 299. We have Ray Lewis, Cam Newton. Backwards? Third auto. Okay, interesting. Third auto, and we get Swifted. So three autos in this box. 
Uh, DeAndre Swift, that is going to be non-numbered, it looks like. But it is awesome. I'll take that. Hey, when you're not expecting a third auto and you hit a Swift, it doesn't even feel like I got Swifted. A lot of people really high on Swift. So uh, apparently now I just have a Swift Super Collection because this is like my third one in a few boxes. Uh, so we'll go ahead and set that with the auto. See what else is in here. We've got Clyde Edwards E. Lair, Gridiron King. Such a good card. Another Jordan Love. To 199. Is this Marshall Folk? Sure is Marshall Folk. And T. Higgins. I thought maybe a Burrow right there. And a Chase Young on the clearly Don Russ. Whole lot of Chase Young. If you are doing group breaks, the Washington football team is a great team to get. So many rookies for the football team in this product. All right. We are down to one pack it should have our relic are we gonna get a fourth auto can that happen can we get double what we're supposed to get maybe an rpa we do have a prism black we do have two prism blacks in here oof okay okay including a silver i'm digging it i'm digging it as long as the silver does not have any surface issues we'll save the silver i just realized we didn't get a relic so two silvers uh three autos no, no relic we have cd lamb there's a Joe Burrow. All right. There is a Henry Ruggs. That one's going to be numbered to 199. We'll take that. That is going to be a Clear Vision Red. Prism Black is going to be Chase Claypool and a Clear Vision Herbert. Okay. All right. I like where this pack is going, and we still have a Silver to sweat out as well. If we can just see another Herbert, I think we'll be good. So Herbert Clear Vision, we'll definitely uh, top load that one up. Definitely sleeve up that, and we will check this one in a second. Chase Claypool with a clean surface. Thank you, Panini. Final card in the box. <laughs> Gonna be T. Higgins. Close yet far. T. Higgins Silver, that was a very unique box. I've not seen one like that. Three autos, two Prism Black Silvers, and I think we got four Prism Blacks total. Again, Prism Blacks are the uh, premier card in the set, pretty much the one you want to be hitting. Uh, let's take a little recap. Yeah, four Prism Blacks, two Silvers, going to be Brandon Ayuk and T. Higgins, Justin Jefferson, and Chase Claypool as well. Uh, come over here, we hit the... Uh, Clear Vision, Justin Herbert. That's pretty good. Uh, some other stuff. The Henry Ruggs to 199. A Joey B, a Jordan Love, a Jalen Hurts. Eason, Tua. So, again, even for what I would consider to be probably, definitely not as good as my last box, but probably an average box, you hit all of these rookies, uh, all these QB rookies, excuse me. Uh, so that's nice. And then three autos in the box. So that was cool. We hit, uh, we missed the relic, uh, which are usually white paper napkins. Uh, Brandon, I or sorry, J.K. Dobbins to 75. There is the Iok to 149. And the Swift, which is not numbered. But hey, three autos. It's very rare that Panini uh, gives you more than you bargain for. And hey, I will take just about any of these guys as an auto over a relic. That is going to do it. Uh, I knew it run it back season was not a good idea. It was going to be a very, very tall task to live up to that box. But when you hit some monsters and when you hit a monster box, you, you kind of have to press your luck, right? Got to, got to try it one more time. Got to, got to spin the, got to roll the dice just one more time, right? That's how you do it. Otherwise you're not a true gamer. That is going to do it for me today. If you are new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it. Maybe we'll do some Chronicles H2. We're definitely going to do a lot of Chronicles hobby in the coming weeks once I get my hands on some. Uh, but that is going to do it for me today. Take care. Stay safe. Rip some of this product. Even at 600 bucks. it's a fun rip. And uh, we'll catch you next time on Down the Road.